if you look at the screen if you notice I have a goat so I'm a poor bastard right now <laughs> uh, like I try to ask for this one person some money they ain't want to give it to me I even asked a homeless man if he got any spare gold he looked at me like I was crazy but you know what I said you know what it's cool it's fine whatever screw them because today I actually have an idea or a way to help you all out so before we start I want to want to give this huge huge suggestion to you all if you notice the dojo blacksmith the shop and the stable are all maxed out and if you look at the screen again you notice that my lumber mineral and fabric is at zero as well and you must be wondering well why is that because you can actually sell them to get extra, you know, get extra gold, of course. So that's what I want to show you today. So I want to make this short, make this short and quick for you all. So the stage I'm pick, and if you like, you can also do this as well. Uh, definitely, I would say like if you want to do on normal, it's fine. Hard nightmare, whatever you feel comfortable doing, you can definitely do it. I would also recommend doing it on the high level star stage just like the one I'm about to do so for this battle I'm going to pick Mitsuhide and Nobunaga usually for this run I I've been doing it a few times I mostly have picked Mitsuhide it's and usually like I'll leave Nobunaga as a secondary or you can pick anyone that you feel comfortable with you can pick as a secondary now there's a reason why I said this stage because for one it's short and two it's straight through and also and from from my experience it's real easy to get an S rank in this stage if you do it right so like these noble nugget right here. Yeah, so this is the reason why I, I pit Mitsuhide because of his OP slash. Yeah, make sure not to have like your troops to just like steal your to steal the kill. It will go it will go to your points, but it won't uh, you won't get like all of them. Make sure you finish like all the missions as well to increase your chances to get an S rank. And at the same time, if you notice my combo, my combo count it increases. You don't want it to drop to zero. Now at some point, if you feel like it's going to drop, uh, make sure you try to recover real quick with a Muso or yeah, yeah, like a Muso or pretty much a move like that. And every chance you get, just make sure to bring out your troops. It increases your points. Yeah, 
残らず切り伏せる You also, like, you also get your chances of increasing gold if you have an、um, ultimate skill that's really good against archers. That's about it. Is like I said, it's real easy to get an S on this stage. Real easy and simple. Yeah, so that's it. A j a p t e s completed. This should be an S rank here. So, of course, you know, you get more gold when you actually get a high. When you get the S rank, you get more gold, of course. And also additional materials as well. If you notice、um, the skill gems at the bottom,、um, since the max out is 20, i s you know, the ones that that's like owned and it's 20, that and, and also like the ones that says acquired. So the ones that are acquired, they're going to turn into gold. They're going to convert into gold. As mentioned right here. And also you get weapons as well. Did not expect to do this one soon, but let, let's just make it early.
Okay. So if you notice now, I got well close to 36k gold. And as I mentioned earlier, you can sell your materials. So with the gold you acquired plus the weapon, the weapon sold just now, plus you know selling it, you should get a grand total of. Yeah, like a yeah, grand total of more than a hundred k. So if you notice now that you can definitely get gold, pretty much like ninety k to a hundred k gold, um, less than less than ten minutes. I want to say five minutes, but I want to sound a little clip baity. So definitely less than 10 minutes, you can definitely get more gold. You can get this amount of gold, or like I said, amount this amount of gold, or just maybe around 90,000. Now, if you get to 90,000 or a little less, and you feel like, you know, you need more gold, you can definitely sell uh, unnecessary weapons and all, and then it should help you out. So after you get all this gold, you can use it to, you know, buy scrolls, materials, and you can even, you know, increase your um, whatever weapon you're working on you can increase that as well so for this case I'm just going to spend all my gold on on scrolls because why not <laughs> uh, yeah so Pretty much that's about it. And I'm poor again. <laughs> but like I said, I hope this video help you help you all. If you got any questions or concerns or maybe some what if situations that you are thinking and you're not sure, definitely leave a comment down below. Please like and subscribe as well as I would definitely be doing more videos.